Well, since it's Valentine's Day, there's nothing that makes us feel better than a compliment, right? So we're gonna be reading secret admirer notes from people around the office. If you're a condiment, you would be the ketchup. Everyone loves ketchup. She's better than Mary Poppins. Not practically perfect in every way. She truly is perfect in every way. Aw, she's more like a saint from her flowing chestnut mane to her cashew toe. I think she might actually be a direct product of Jesus himself. Wow, that's a lot to live up to. I love her. When I feel like I don't have time to pick something up, she says, I got you. I'll have my assistant get it. <laughs> You're like tequila. That doesn't leave you with a burning sensation, okay? Justin frustrates the hell out of all of us sometimes, but his energy is so positive that it makes me smile just to be around him. Every person deserves a Justin in their life. Ah! You put up with so much from all of us, and yet you keep coming back to work. And you're soft like a teddy bear. If cartoon bluebirds were real, a couple of them would be sitting on your shoulder singing right now. Oh, that is so cute. <laughs> Thanks for filling my heart with joy and nostrils with smells of good cooking. Unless you burn the food or cook food on paper plate in the toaster oven and it gets smoky. Yeah, I've done that. Why is this joke always about me? I love pineapple on pizza. I smile every time I see your dog Cowboy's ashes <laughs> displayed on your desk and my dog's ashes are on my desk. I didn't know where else to put them, so I figured the office would be a good conversation starter. I love that when I have a bad day, he always reminds me that at least I haven't thrown all my money away opening up bars. He's so selfless. Thanks. My favorite crazy Mexican besides Jenna's boyfriend. You've known the guy like a month. Half of you haven't even met him yet. <laughs> Yolanda has more admirers than Jenna and Big Al have marbles combined. <laughs> and my love for her is just as big as her boobs. <laughs> I don't know what's more full right now. Jenna's heart, her egg basket, or my love for her. That's nice. My egg basket's empty now though. Kelly, think of the most beautiful flower in a colorful garden of happiness. That's Kelly Raspberry. Okay, somebody just had to make up something so they came up with that. I love part-time Justin's boyish grin and handsome looks, which is pretty much the only masculine thing about him. <laughs> yeah, I can have a really masculine look to myself, um, but as soon as I talk, people just, just know I'm gay. <laughs> she could probably stay calm in a crisis. I'd be okay having her as my 911 operator in an emergency. Hands down, the only person I would trust to help me move a dead body. Hmm. Like a Ken doll came to life, and I'm just looking for my Barbie. Just kidding, I have one. My wife. Best abs in the office. In fact, the only guy with abs in the office. <laughs> yeah, not, not much competition, huh? You are no longer someone I pretend not to see in public. When Ariana Grande sings the lyric, my smile is beaming, my skin is gleaming. She's talking about Jenna. He's so cute and adorable. When he eats his little orange cuties, I get all excited because it's like, Oh, look, it's a cutie with a cutie. That has to be part-time justice. Big Al, he's so big, soft, and squishy. No wonder he's the best cuddler in the office. They do call me Big Squishy. I envy Shannon's confidence and wit. And they spelled my name wrong. Anna's a full package. She has good jokes. I just made that up, they didn't say that. <laughs> Anna's a full package. She has good looks, <laughs> great hair, Alan's affection, and she's super funny. <laughs> wow, <laughs> who loves me more than me, am I right? JC's heart is as big as his muscles. I like his muscles. Thank you. Trey has the nicest butt in the office. Thanks, Justin. Every day it's hard to watch him leave, but I love to watch him go. There's so I dropped something behind the couch. Oh yeah, I got it, it's good. I would love to spend every minute of every day with you, but some days I actually have to get stuff done. <laughs> That's true, because you know me, I am a distraction. Work, work, I don't work. I would want you as president of my homeowners association. Aw, thanks. Y'all, Alicia is like pineapple on pizza, sweet and perfectly in place. You may freeze your eggs, but you warm my heart but you set my loins on fire. More than a big heart, Al's caring personality puts the cherry on top of the whole show, and his jokes are sometimes funny. I go for sometimes. 
sometimes funny is good. You're all that in a bag of Lay's potato chips. I'm as attracted to Robert as he is to food. A lot. Amy is cooler than the cool mom from Mean Girls. Yes! I know Kelly gets compliments on her legs, but we don't mention Lacey's enough. Them lunges are paying off. The mother I hope to be. That's so nice. Being awesome is hard, but you always manage. I'm not going to point out that they left out a comma. To me, you are Pedro Pan, the Hispanic boy who never grew up. I love your boyish and playful nature. You always try to see the positive in any situation. Nick is the creamer to my coffee. Sweet, nice, and vanilla. Russ is so small and cute, I just want to put him in my pocket for safekeeping. Trey is like a super sweet guy locked up in a turtle shell. It's super cute when he pokes his sweet turtle head out of the shell and shows it, but pretty much no one will ever see how truly sweet he can be unless they run him over with a car and break his shell into pieces. Best beard in the office. It really has come in quite a bit. It was a big day in my career when Big Al learned my name. <laughs> I'll cherish that forever. Aww. That's from, uh, what's her name? All I want to do is give Robert a hug. Maybe one day he'll let me.